I have something serious to talk about. I know what's been happening with a lot of different creators right here on the YouTube platform. Hopefully YouTube is working on this, but there are truly a lot of bots out there in the comments section of different YouTube content creators videos telling you guys that a giveaway is going on for a video game system, this, that, and the third. It's not happening. Ladies and gentlemen, unless you hear the words coming up out of my mouth that I'm actually giving something away, I'm not giving anything away. Especially in the comments section. It has to happen in a direct video of me telling you exactly what you need to do to get said item. I have not done so. I don't know who these individuals are or who these bots are, but please do not give away your information, your email. Don't give away no money. Don't give away your home address. Don't give away your telephone number to anybody. You hear what I'm saying to you? Keep yourself safe. Don't fall for the scammers. There's a lot of scamming going on in this platform. Again, hopefully YouTube is up on game and they're going to take care of the issue. But until then, do your due diligence to make sure you don't get caught out there. Dame drops, I'm not giving away anything. When I do, you will know because I will tell you. Until then, don't fall for the okie doke in the comment section. And right now, just go ahead and put I am not a bot in the comment section. Lock it in with a thumbs up. We got to get these bots and scammers out of here. Now let's get into these ribs. All right, fam. Looks like Arby's is over here challenging McDonald's because they know McDonald's is coming back out with their McRib this month. Arby said, nah, baby, you want rib? Come try our ribs. Oh, they got Reese's peanut butter cookie. What? Reese's peanut butter cup cookie. Oh, y'all get freaky. Hi, welcome to Arby's. How may I help you? How you doing? Let me uh, get your new country style rib. All right, this is sandwich of the meal. I'll take the whole meal. Crinkle curly. What was that? Crinkle or curly fries? Uh, crinkle fries is fine. All right, small medium large. Large, please. And I'll take um, I'll take a large water. All right, is that all for you? Yes, that'll be all. Would you like to donate a dollar and go okay, go hungry? Sure. Thank you for your donation. I'll have full up food, though. All right, thanks. Being the fact that McDonald's is about to re-release their flagship McRib that comes out every year pretty much or every couple months Arby said we want to get ahead of the game mm, mm, mm. either I'm hella hungry y'all or that just smell real good in the hood what's this what's this oh because I hit him with the donation piece all right so you know I want to showcase everything to your family you have the Arby's foundation donate out for the kids you know what I'm saying they only ask for an additional dollar I'm pretty sure we all could afford that, no doubt. Uh, oh, man. I want to get to these crinkle cut fries so bad, y'all. But first, for my foodie fam out there that loves it, and for the kids, a ghetto nap. A ghetto nap. A ghetto nap. Uh, Rocking to the beat. Brill, 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 brill. A ghetto nap. A ghetto nap. I can't hear you. A ghetto nap. Oh, Rocking to the beat. Brill. Bill, bro, hit me off. This right here is just whatever goes past the beard. It doesn't really land on the hoodie. You know? But um, I don't know, fam. Can y'all let me know in the comment section below which fries you prefer, Arby's? Do you like the crinkle cut joints? Here, go ahead and take a look at these joints. Go ahead, get your get your get your eyeballs on them. Get your eyeballs on them. Uh huh. The crinkle cut. These joints look like they hit that fryer proper, don't they? A little bit past golden brown and looking dumb crispy with enough salt to make a difference. Oh, oh shit. Yo, hold up. Family? I haven't had Arby's crinkle cut action in a minute. But this is this one right here, this, this particular batch, took me somewhere. Now, you have to be my age to remember this. Let's go all the way back to intermediate intermediate school. Seventh and eighth grade for me. I went to Worcester and Stratford, Connecticut. They used to give us the red lunch trays. And I always remember getting like a carton of fruit punch. I might get some little like raggedy Elio's pizza. Pizza was always suspicious. The pizza there was always suspicious at school. But the french fries they would give us, they were these. They were these. 
I'm wondering if Arby's provided the french fries for my school back then because these taste just like those mm, light fluffy potato action. You probably wonder why I got my finger like this. This is for the pincher fry. If you ain't got your fingers like this, you ain't pinching your fries proper. Light potato action. These joints crinkled up, crinkled up. Crispy exterior. But the potato game was a puff of happiness on the interior. It's like they were dipped in a salt bowl and turned. You know what I'm saying? And shook up a little bit. No part of salt missed these fries at all. Arby's. You might be in the running right now for best French fry in the game. You might be in the... You might be in the running for best French fry right now. Mm -hmm. Nostalgic fries. Mm. Okay, enough of that. No, not enough. Hold up. Dude, I'm sorry. I'm just a slapper. Mm, don't ever. Mm. I gotta keep you close. Don't fall. I just got my truck detail. Come on, baby. Don't do me. Don't do me dirt. Don't do me dirt. All right, y'all. What you been waiting for? I know. I know. I know. The Arby's rib sandwich. Oh! And the cookie. Mm, and the little cookie boogie. I got. Oh, why you? you you stupid soft Reese's cup cookie. Yo, the Reese's cookie, y'all. Yo, this joint right here. And it's warm too. Oh, the fat boy inside and outside of me. Can't wait to get to you. Anyway, let's get back to the rib sandwich, shall we? Now the rib sandwich comes in a Chick-fil-A uh, chicken sandwich diaper. Cause you know how Chick-fil-A get down. It's just like this. So let's, not, let's not play them games like Chick-fil-A and Popeyes don't get down this way. Heat it up. That heat seal action on the inside. Oh, look how thick that joint is, fam. I didn't even take it out. Yo, hold up. Y'all saw the th Y'all saw the thickness. Let me come in. Come in. McDonald's McRib could never. Fam. Soft. Mm -hmm. I'm getting rib sauce all over me. Oh, these are official ribs. Look, 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 look at those ribs. Look at those thick ribs right there. I hope they're soft on the bite. I hope it's not tough. I really do. I really do. With rib sauce all over the place. All over my fingers. I need one of these ghetto naps. Because I know I'm going to make a mess. And that mess won't be hard to confess. It sins all over my outfit. Mm. All right, y'all. You know what we came to do? Flip that thing up. Pinky up for what? Please somebody say it in the comment section below. Why does the pinky go up? Why? 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 Huh? Yes, for extra flair. You ain't new around here. You ain't new around here. You true around here. Yes, pinky up for extra flavor. This drink, bun game soft. What's that little bit of mo' better cheddar in there? Mo' better cheddar blues? With a little bit of rib sauce and rib. Ah. Let me get some of this water. Let me get on the water game. Nice and cold, nice and bold. Look, family, can we talk about it? These ribs, they have a, now I ain't gonna say a tender fender bender, not tender, but they have a soft bite to them. But because of how thick they are, and, and the choice of rib, they're not moist, right? They're flavorful, but they're not moist. And the sauce, Arby's, this is a good rib sauce. An amazing rib sauce, it is not. A good rib sauce, it is. It's savory. It's not sweet. All right? You get the smokiness. You get the hickory love. However, if it's not sauced properly, I can see how the ribs and their thickness will get tightened up in the throat tolicles right about here just a little bit. 
and individuals might actually be in their fields. I don't get much of that crisp onion ring. It's been dumbed down, which is fine. The bread is really thick. It's a nice soft bite. Toast it up with a little bit of love. Un poquito. Like, it's a little bit of love, you know what I'm saying? And um, it's, it's not horrible. But you're coming for the McRib. And McRib has a strong following about it. And we're going to cover that when it drops. And the way we're going to cover it is I'm going to bring you to the McRib party. That way we can see what we do right on both sides and what we do wrong on both sides. Because there's certain things about the McRib that I personally, I don't love. And there's certain things about Arby's rib sandwich that I personally do not love. I like. We can have a good friendship. We just can't have a relationship. You hear what I'm saying to you? Like, and I'm not trying to curve you. You know, I am curving you. But just understand there's some tweaking that we should do for next year. Arby's, holla at me because I could taste what we need to tweak. I can slide over to your HQ, Arby's. We could talk about some things because this particular rib sandwich has possibilities but I ain't going to give that to you for free. I ain't giving that to you for free. Foodie fam, what do you feel about Arby's rib sandwich? Again, for me, thick rib, that's good. I like that. Nice bite, that's good. I like that. Not moist, not succulent, savory with that hickory sauce game, that's cool. If we're going to add in crispies, onion ring crisp, we got to make sure them joints are crispy. You hear what I'm saying to you? Them joints can't be blended in like that. They need to be an afterthought if you're going for crispiness mixed in with your rib. Now, if you're just going for flavor, understandable, just know you have to change the sauce if you don't want to drown out the flavor of your fried onion ring on the interior body here because it's drowned out. It's drowned out between the bread. It's drowned out between the thickness of your rib and definitely drowned out because the choice of a deep-rooted sauce more on the smokier side of life you don't even know there's any onion ring action within the sandwich. You can visually see it, you just don't know what's happening. And you can see the potential. This joint got potential, but it's just, it's a three piece. It's a three piece right now on the rib sandwich scale for fast food. Again, Arby's, there's a lot of things that you do right. This one you just did okay. But you can't possibly come for the McRib with that. You can't, you can't, I'm, you can't, you can't. And it could just be location, could be location, 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 but the McRib got some things going on about it where we all know it's, you know, it's a little questionable rib. McDonald's, I ain't gonna stunt. You got a questionable rib game. Oh, we gotta get into this cookie. Barbies. I'm gonna need you to work on that. If you don't get me, get another food influencer or somebody that can help you with that rib game. Because it, it needs help. I ain't gonna lie to you. Oh, oh I like when the package is... And you smell the peanut butter action. If anybody allergic to peanuts, yo, I apologize up front. That's why I'm doing it on this side of the camera. But this joint right here, fam. Look at look, 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 look at the. You see it folded? Look, look, look. I just want to show you the break on that. Ooh, ooh that's soft. Mmm. Mmm. Are you gonna come out? I'm not making too much of a mess, cause I want to show you to, to the people. Come here. Come here. Mm. Mm. I'm trying to show y'all. Okay. It's so soft that I can't even hold the cookie up without it breaking. But. Right, right. It's one of these situations, y'all. It's one of these situations. Look at that crumble. Look at that crumble. That's cookie crumble right there. That's. Mm. And you chocolate. Oh, well. Mm. 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 You good, but I gotta stop messing with you. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. It tastes just as a Reese's Pieces crumble cookie should. That cookie, thick peanut butter, <laughs> flavor, outstanding. The chocolatiness. It's slightly encompassing the cookie. It's holding and coddling the cookie. I like where it's going. Very tasty, if nothing else. It's very tasty. Good job. Good job. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, I thank you guys for coming out here. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, I appreciate you guys for watching this video. Um, any 
comments, questions, or and or concerns, please leave them in the comment section. I, re I do read my comments. I might not get to all of them, but I, I do check them out. We get down here weekly, so I do drop videos here every single week. Again, a quick reminder, please don't get scammed in the comment section of anybody's videos where they're offering giveaways for this, that, and the third. Money, don't exchange nothing, don't give away your personal information until YouTube gets a hold on the scamming and the bots within their system. Until they get a stronghold and can remove that and stop it from happening, please be careful out there, all right? Because I'm not giving away anything right now, and that's just me telling y'all. When I do, you will know. I'm about to slide about here, fam. I'm going to try to enjoy the rest of this day. It's beautiful outside. You are beautiful outside and inside. Don't you ever forget it. You're amazing. Don't you ever forget it. You're going to be successful. If you're not successful right now, it is coming. Success is coming your way. Don't you forget it. You don't let anybody dim your shine. You hear what I'm saying to you? You don't let that happen. All right? You are your own hype person. You hear what I'm saying to you? Your own hype person. You got this. Today might not be great. Tomorrow is going to be better. Whatever you're going through, you are going to get through, and you're going to come out on the other end much stronger. You hear what I'm saying to you? You got this. We got you. This is a family right here, Foodie Fam. It's your boy Drops. I'll holla. Drops. Super.